this is the news we have uh btc's wobble continues so we'll have on common collapse blog uh article was done by connor Seftin, uh market museums alexandra so table of contents we'll be looking at the biggest best crypto news ever bitcoin falls further ftx trading volume surge crypto is forbidden uh muslims want and we have blockchains big role in digital identities so guys we have a uh, Come and carry caps podcast here available on Apple Podcasts, Spotify, and Google Podcasts, guys. So Bitcoin falls further. Bitcoin has continued to drift further from all time highs, pouring cold water on the idea that a further rally and new record prices are imminent. So the world's biggest cryptocurrency was trading an exceedingly tight uh, range for most of uh, Thursday, remaining stuck between uh, four thousand dollars to six five thousand dollars. Although BTC managed to break its $5,000 on multiple occasions, it struggled to remain above this price. And on Friday morning, Bitcoin plunged from its $5,000 to $63,000 in a little over an hour. So we also have FTX uh, trading volume surge, 512%. So, uh, trade volume at Sam Bankman's fried uh, FTX US cryptocurrency exchange uh, surged in Q3. Jumping 512% in three months, the uh, platform saw an average daily volume of $360 million in that period, uh, spiking to $807 million on September 7, it said. So FTX uh, US also claimed to have increased its user base by more than 50% and seen its share of the US cryptocurrency spot market more than uh, double about 2% in Q2 to 4.5% in Q3. So you can look at the numbers there directly. So then crypto is forbidden in Muslim. So Indonesia's religious uh, council has declared trading cryptocurrency around or forbidden under Sharia law. So we have uh, Bloomberg's reported on November 11 that the National Ulema uh, Council or MUI banned Muslims from trading cryptocurrency as it has elements of authenticity, wagering and uh, arm. So the ruling does not have the force of law but it will likely deter traders as well as giving local companies pause before insuring cryptocurrencies. I also have uh, blockchain's big role in digital uh, identities. So blockchain, uh, artificial intelligence and biometrics will form the technological core of a rapidly growing digital identity market over the next decade. So a new report predicts driven by rising security threats and the ongoing uh, digital uh, transformation of commerce and uh, government services tokenized id will uh, redefine security and uh, identity recognition by 2030 so according to frost and sullivan so these systems could identify us based uh, on our, our keystrokes so our voice and even our mouse use so guys, uh, that's all from uh, Come and Cap today. It's week review, weekly review. If you have any questions, don't forget to like, share, uh, to ask us in the comments section. You can also like, share, and uh, com- uh, subscribe to our YouTube channel, guys. Uh, if you have any uh, updates, any questions, feedbacks, feel free to let us know. We'll try as much as possible to attend to you. Then, guys, you want to subscribe to our YouTube channel because we're going to be giving our giveaways to our first. 1,000 to 5,000 subscribers to be part of this uh, giveaway you want to stay subscribed then once it kickstarts you should be part of the lucky winners so peace out guys and stay safe